Hello there. I have just recently finished reading The Where the Devil by Robert Lee. Um, it's out of print, so I got it for real cheap, luckily, but uh, it was like $40 uh, online, so I got real lucky, got it for real cheap. But um, <clears throat> it's about a man named Robert Lee, the, the author writing about himself, who, um, he, he, Decides he wants to dabble in spiritualism, you know, see what it's about, and goes to the spiritualist church, and they recommend him uh, try playing with a Ouija board, and he actually concocts one out of a uh, cardboard, you know, and uses a, uh, you know, just like a, a glass like 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 this, um, to uh, as as like the thing that moves around, and uh, does it with his wife and his kids, you know real young kids and luckily he was the only one that ended up tormented but he ended up hearing voices from the guide some versions say the muse um and uh you know a, a, a side note here even people that are really into um occultism and stuff like that and tarot cards and and stuff are not big advocates of Ouija boards um the uh, I haven't heard any positive stories coming out of them and some people play with them and say you know I've been fine but it's a lot like Russian roulette you don't know when you're gonna get bit um but anyway yeah he started hearing voices in his head and things just start going very very badly for him. I'm not going to spoil the book for you, but um, he has to eventually seek out uh, a, a group of fellow Christians, and uh, I don't want to, you know, go all preachy on this, but from what I've heard, the only positive, the only real solution to demonic possession or ghosts or whatever you may call it, spirits, whatever, Jesus is the only real solution to such things. It's the only proven, tried and true solution. Um, every, every everything else, the the demons can will subside, whatever, uh, because they're fooling you or because it actually temporarily works, but they always come back. Um, and it, Jesus is the only real solution to such things. And I think we seek out things like this. We seek out Ouija boards. We watch these ghost shows on TV. I used to be really into ghost stuff, paranormal stuff, and I'll still read books about this kind of stuff to, you know, educate myself and, you know, become more learned. Uh, but it, I mean, there's, there's no, you know, if, if there's a heaven and a hell, you're, you're playing with fire. Um, and I think that a lot of people, they investigate this kind of stuff because, um, I think it, it, it's part of our being to, to seek out a relationship with God. And because we are naturally in the same way bent away from God ever since Adam and Eve, ever since the devil became part of the picture, which is the beginning, we have been bent away from God. And part of it is it's just easier to be evil. It's, part, it's, it's easier... To, it's less of a burden to be, you know, in, in communion with God, to be in a relationship with God, to pursue God. Um, so we, you know, we, we often just take take the easy path. Um, but anyway, I'm speaking of paths. I'm, I'm rabbit trailing here. But the point is, is that people pursue Ouija boards. People pursue all the spiritualism because they are seeking something that they cannot have, that something that is beyond what they can see, something more, and I think they're misguided, and I think a lot of it's just people, you know, people that are curious, people that are bored, you know, they want to experience something beneficial, and I think that is a relationship with Jesus, and it is a hard path, but it is a fulfilling path, um, and it's, you know, it's, it's not as easy as sinning, but it's, it is far more fulfilling. But anyway, um, I am droning on. This video was not my 
best work, but it is very uh, unprepared. Uh, so, Robert Lee, Beware the Devil. If you could find a copy of this for cheap, um, buy one. Buy as many copies as you can. Give them to your friends, whatever. Um, it's an excellent read. If you're not a Christian, I, I highly recommend this book. Not as a, a method to preach to you, although it does definitely fulfill that. But it's just, it's a very chilling and engaging read. It, it is not to promote um, such things. In fact, it is a great tool of keeping people away from such things. If you were thinking of playing with a Ouija board, you may think twice after reading this book. So, anyway, for Where the Devil, check it out. It's a great book.